Well, topic. topic. <laughs> I'm Tanya. I'm Kim. Oh my gosh, it's been so long. It has too, been too long. Yo, where we been? This is disrespectful. <laughs> we have to do better. Like I'm we, so sorry for our fans because our fans have been asking us like, for what like, happened? what happened? What happened? Where you at? Where you going? Where you at? And we have to say. Right. We've had lives and that have taken us. Lifing. We've been lifing for sure. Lifing? Lifing. That's. that's Called vacationing. Mm-hmm. You went on a cruise, bro. Yeah. I'm hating. I'm low key hating because I didn't go. You know, don't hate. I, I'm going to hate about it. No, I am. Oh. Mm-hmm. I'm going to hate because they did it on. I understand. Everybody got a birthday. And people got to share some days <laughs> together, right? But my son turned 16 years old. Do you have a 16-year-old? My youngest. That's my youngest. And my oldest just moved out. My middle son is going back to probably Missouri for college. Like, I'm going to be an empty nester. Welcome. But you know I'm a little different, though. No, we're going to control you. <laughs> we're gonna, I mean, we're I'm a little control. different. We're going to be. <laughs> but I have to say. I really like this era that I'm in. I'm starting to yeah, like season, myself. The yes, the the season. The season. I feel like you when you know like when I said it. I said I don't the season. Know. No, you don't like the season? Mm. You're different now. I am. But you know, we have to like from afar you see your little baby duckling start doing stuff, you know. <laughs> and then you got to be like, "Okay, come on. Come, on, come, come to see." <laughs> That's how I feel with you right now. <laughs> you in your riddle post. What is so, that? like, first of all, that was the wrong thing that Instagram did. <laughs> was allow me, or allow anyone. To put, like, random thoughts. Random thoughts. What is this? 60 thing? characters. 60 characters. Only 60 characters. There's only 60 characters. Say what you mean, mean what you say. So, that was the wrong thing they did. They're riddles. I don't, I don't appreciate it. I love my riddles. You know why? Because you have people like me going, Ke? <laughs> Ke? <laughs> I read That's someone. That's I text you. I go, <laughs> drunk messaging? What's happening? What are you doing? What happened? <laughs> Who said what? What's going on, I kid? Go there. <laughs> I know it. It could be because it's on there for twenty four hours. So sometimes oh, in that mode, after twenty four hours, yes. Oh, I'm not good at that. And then that's why I be changing it up because my mood be changing. <laughs> that's like my best mood ring, expressing my mood. But sometimes it has nothing to do with me. If Why you can see this because I know that those of you that listen on Spotify cannot <laughs> see me blinking. <laughs> I wish I wish I had the long Here's eyelashes the that the girls wear now, so you can hear the <laughs> of my of my eyelashes. <laughs> the fact that you I get so many messages like, "Yeah, girl, that's what I was saying." This and that, and then, and then you come out, you're like, "What happened? Who said that to you?" Why do you feel like, are you okay? Do you need me to go talk to somebody? I'm like, no, I'm actually really good. It had nothing to do with me today. Oh, oh my face hurts. That, that, I'm that friend. I'm that friend. It's so crazy. I'd be reading in between lines, letters. I'd be like, wait, is that okay? Mm. And, it, is it? and then, then you'd be like, I'd be putting that emoji, that girl emoji, like, mm. And then you'd be like, why? Why you did that? That's you. Are you that guessing? Me- Who are you questioning? <laughs> See, but don't feed into the hype of all these other people. Like, yeah, girl, get it, girl. I no, don't. I, I need to know I laugh. what I say before I co-sign anything. I need to know. I'm not co-signing. No. no. One time I put, I forgot what I put. I was like, I guess don't be mad when you drop something uh, you or whatever okay. and someone else picks it up. Some people called me out. They were like, word? So I dropped you? I said. I was just saying, if you drop a dollar bill, I should have put the dollar, but I only had 60 characters. Uh, so I said, when you drop something, don't be mad when someone else picks it up. Or just put the emoji dollar. Like if you It drop- takes up three characters. I tried. I, I tried. Way too much, but you don't know about threads. <laughs> you know, you're an you're a IG pro with this whole little, but you don't know about threads. Girl, what? Threads just came out. When, that thre- when the threads. <laughs> you don't have threads. <laughs> what is this? Who gets threads? The pastor. Yes. Well, he knows. first of all, I didn't realize that Facebook changed their name. Did you know that? To so Meta, that one? Oh, you know. <laughs> I said that. <laughs> <laughs> we can talk about this. Hey, hey, we can talk about this. Oh. No, 
no, we are. We have yeah, to talk it, about it this was, because I didn't know that. They were like, oh, because I, you know, at my job, we have social media. And they were like, yeah. You know, no, we do. Us. No, my company does now. I just found out about it yesterday. It, okay, so let me tell you about the meta thing. It came out a few days ago, no? So. But, um, the thread, threads. So met, meta. Meta. Mm-hmm. So Facebook. Like metaverse. You know. Yay. Like I feel like. Doo, 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 you doo, so doo, busy doo, in your doo, new doo. season. You're not paying attention. For <laughs> real. <laughs> I know it's not easy being me okay so anyway so the meta thing came out and uh, one of my students was like yeah you, one of your videos is talking about the Facebook and that's so like it, it's so Facebook. outdated and everything is now called meta and everything like that and I was like oh you're so right I had to google it and I was like oh Facebook's now meta I need a pillow I need a me me <laughs> When she talks about these things, I need a meme. Me. Oh, oh now, oh now, you know, I got one up on you. You're younger than me. You be then. Like, so yesterday, I I'm at my office and we're talking about social media and stuff. Look, you know, about our company and all the followers and stuff. And then they were like, "So we just got thread. You know, our boss um, has the account. He's did posted a few like things." Did and you, I'm like, did you think something was? I was like, "What is that?" that? I said, what? Is, I said it. I don't care. I'm I have no that. shame. No shame in my game. There going, yeah. I'm like I did with the meta day. thing. With the meta thing, I did that. I was like, you right. Man. Had no clue what he was talking about until I looked it up. Okay. Now, Instagram, I'm like, wow, this is called threads. So I understand what's going on. I look at my social media, and guess what? Off topic, got threads. And I said, we do? <laughs> And it was a good video. And I sent, I posted it, and somehow and you got, it must have shared it to TikTok or something. And no, you and added you me. <laughs> I was, and then you go and share. I'm like, oh, she must have threads. And you're like, and I you were like, you, you have threads account? I was like, yeah. no, I do not. In fact, I just did it right now. And I'm stuck so, okay. on my bio. Okay, so let's, let's talk about the bio after. Because you know me. Unless if it, people want to comment on the little that they know of you. What mm. would they put as your bio? That's a good question. Yeah, I think so. she cray cray. Uh, she fun. She's oh, I thought honest. you were about to say she fine. I mean, oh, she's so nice. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that's my new season, boo. <laughs> help me help her, y'all. Please. I mean, you know. But let's get back to the cruise. So okay. It was my baby cousin's 40th birthday. Woo, woo. And I would not have enjoyed that cruise if I wasn't with the people that I was with. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I wasn't on it. it you would have had more fun. A, I think everybody would have more fun if I was there. It was a, I don't know. I probably would have been trying to find you in your new season. <laughs> I would have been doing the limbo I, line, going through the buffet I did line. Dance I did when, yeah. I, you I, did? I did? That's what I'm talking you about. Did. You know what? You represent it. You know. We had, you should have had a shirt that said Off Topic Podcast. A, oh, that's a good video. Oh, that's a good <gasps> video. You got to put my, it on. And my little cousin Sabrina's like, do this, I do that. I, do. I was like, calm down. Calm down. <laughs> it was so funny. It was great. So that's I'm saying awesome. the people I was with was great, but I, I do have to say, I like diversity. Uh huh. And it was not a diverse cruise. Really? What cruise line did you go on? <laughs> no, but for the record, for the record, so so for the record, I think that's the most diverse, youngest, craziest. A lot of things go on on Carnival. So I always try to remember. Try is the operative word. Oh, try that. I'm. I can't judge people and how they parent. That like everybody, they we parent off of our experiences. Sometimes we give them the side eye. Let me explain something to you. Sure. I found out about this song on the cruise, and I don't want to put the DJ's name because he should have shut it down. Just put it out there. Go ahead, girl. No, I'm not putting his name out there. <laughs> but the song was called Pound Town. Pound Town. <laughs> That's my season song. Let us get. I just thought that would be funny. I thought that was funny. No, no. Du, 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 du. So <laughs> it was raining outside, and the DJ had to bring everybody into the lounge, and there was a lot of kids there. I met like 
12 year olds, 11 year olds. You've right? met them? No, 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 I was watching them from the side. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Again, you don't want to judge people no. for what they do with their Absolutely. children, blah, blah, blah. Vacation but time. But there was a song, and, it, and the kids knew the song? They so, knew the so song? Word by word. So the, I. Y'all, if anybody knows this song, you would know why I'm stuttering right now and hesitating. Well, I just learned about Mega and um, Meta, Thread. So, Meta. Oh, Meta and Thread. So I don't know this song at all. Oh, you got me. <laughs> but here's the thing. So they talked about my pee is pink or something like that. My, what? My booty hole brown. It was just this thing, right? Oh, God. I'm and grabbing my see, pearls. And to see these kids, like, verbatim, like, they knew every word in that song. That's disrespectful. If O would have turned the camera to me, I was like this. <laughs> I'm all about, you know, we're sexual creatures. And and God didn't put us here. But not at 12 years old. But some of the parents were with the kids like this. <laughs> DJ. Booty hole kid. brown. And I was booty like, <laughs> no, P word pink. I don't want to do that one. No. I do the booty brown because. Oh, you could do that one. <laughs> and I was like, I mean, but that was just, there's more to it. There's more to it. So I talked about this the other day. I went to my aunt's birthday thingy. <clears throat> no, her going away because she she's moving. That's right. And I was talking to my little cousin, my well, younger cousin. Anybody is little to me because they don't know what it means. But um, and she's like, oh, it's called Pound's Time. I'm like, oh, it makes sense. Uh-huh. It makes sense. So she's the one who told you the name of the song? Yes. But the words I heard. Did you hear it a lot on the boat or just one time? Um, I didn't go to the lounges anymore. After that, I wouldn't either. <laughs> First of all, comedy well, I actually walked out of one of the comedy shows. Really? Yeah, I was too. Why? He Raunchy? was. He was too. He was too. He was too vulgar for me. I'm. I'm just built different now. I. Mm. I, I. I. Some things they just they poke at my spirit. Really? Yeah. Walked out. Yeah. No, I. W- I would have been I like, you wouldn't see. see. You're like you're see. crazy. Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. I mean, there's certain things that sometimes, like, I even hear, like, some of the comedians now, and Why I'm sit like, sit there uh, if you can't laugh? Yeah, if I can't laugh, no. I'm not laughing at some of the stuff that you're saying. Right. Like, what you did and or all that stuff. Or calling women yeah. certain things. Oh, yeah, no, 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 no. A lot of people were laughing, and I'm looking at them like, you good with that? And like, you know why? Because they've either called each other that. Right. And they're right. comfortable with that. I did, listen, uh, it was packed. People were standing. It just wasn't for me. I'm not judging anybody that stayed. Did you get there early? Because there were a lot of people. There were a lot of people. No, because we were trying to find the different lounges. Because when it when it rains and things like that, they start shuffling, and then mm. they just announce it. But then you're you can't hear it. Long story short, um, did it rain on the boat? It rained. Yeah, it was stormy. I mean, not like how it, the video that's circulating that's viral on Independence of the Seas, where like people were getting hit in the head with the. You didn't see that either? Oh, I forgot. You went in here season. I'm going to start sending you stuff. <laughs> Send it to me because if it doesn't show up on my TikTok thread. Jazzy and Nene were like, this is not you, right? I'm like, no, <laughs> we're in a complete different boat. But I guess it was a tornado in the water and Royal Caribbean. And I'm sure they're great. I don't want anybody to come back at me. And it is a viral, viral video. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But um, the the... Chairs were flying, hitting people in the head. People were falling. At one point, one flew from the second deck oh, over and a, to and a the car. And there was a little carriage. baby carriage. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, and yes. It, just, it happened like maybe a few days before we went on ours. So I think by the time the kids saw it, they thought we were on that. I was like, well, no. Oh, heck no. Mm-hmm. But anyway, listen, people that were in my party, when I say my party, the people that I yeah, was yeah, on the yeah. cruise with, they stayed for the comedian show, the comedy show. Um, I couldn't rock with it. It was it was fine. So I'm not Did judging you go eat them. something for me. Did you go eat something? Oh, we ate constantly. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Because I would have went, like, the you know what? That pizza. Fire. The pizza was like, why is that pizza eat? so good on a oh, cruise? Like, oh, 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 we ate probably more than me. I get swollen on the cruises. I did too. But I was also right about, like, right before that time. Yeah. So I was not. Oh. Tell me there's no sound. You sure? Oh, you didn't have the camera on? We has sometimes we have Sorry. technical difficulties. Let's be honest. It's okay. <laughs> it's good. He said. <laughs> he said, "Don't play me, bro. I done this." Like your riddles. Mm. <laughs> What's that What's mean? That? <laughs> <laughs> That's how Buddy be looking at me like. <gasps> <gasps> I'm sorry. 
<sighs> so. so it was it was an experience, but being with the people I was with was great. How was the uh, breakfast thing that you did? The Dr. Seuss breakfast. I, I thought Dr. Seuss was pretty awesome. Really? Yeah, I, I like Dr. Seuss, though. What do I have been that for breakfast? <laughs> I mean, I eat regular stuff. There were some green eggs and ham. And Ew. That's disgusting. It's only coloring. It's not food. It's I don't know. Mm-mm. It was Listen, it was somebody tries to... Good. Like, I thought it was good. It was good. Oh. Bacon was cooked. It's not like in Paris. <laughs> you were safe? You played it safe? Good, yeah, good, we, good. we ordered the regular... Regular stuff, mm-hmm. like our brunch there menu. Was like, we have pictures. We haven't posted any of those, but we have pictures with Dr. Seuss. And oh, you guys took pictures with Dr. Seuss. Mm-hmm. With oh, things, how things. fun you! I bought a shirt. I saw so that. I was like okay, you know it's fun. the what is it? The mother of everything or something? Mother of all things. Of all That's things. One, and he was father of all things. That is so cute. It was. Mm. Girl, I don't like that sarcasm. So. You just so mad because you weren't there. <laughs> you could have been. Okay, I don't appreciate it. I don't. Sorry. No, but then guess what? Yes. I saw somebody I knew on the crew. <laughs> Outside of your Side group? Of girl, you know who you are. I said. Outside of your group? Yeah. I said, <gasps> so O goes, where are you going? And I'm, Ping! I run across, and it was somebody I knew. Tanya. <laughs> and the fact that you went, because knowing oh, me, I would have been like, out. oh, I know that person. She stood out. She stood out. She stood out. I would have been like, I know that person. <laughs> No. Okay, move on. As That's soon as it. I saw, we were like, what? And we hugged each of other. Of course you would. Mm-hmm. It was it was good though. It was good. Mm-hmm. You know? I, I thought it Is was that cute. you always find someone. Always. It's never a dull moment. But we did meet someone on the cruise. Okay, yeah. can do they have a place that we can go like snowboarding? <laughs> well, yeah, because she lives in Ohio. I don't want to put her name out here. She may not get this. She may not. She uh she she lives in o- she's from Ohio. She lives in Ohio. And she went to get on the cruise, <clears throat> but her best friend didn't have any ID, no passport, nothing. And she was like, uh so she got on the cruise by herself. <laughs> so wait, let me <laughs> ask you. <laughs> but let's, anyway, I let's guess- be honest. Let's be honest. I'll put this on my bio. Don't play yourself. So if I forgot, because you know me, I'm more of a forgetter. Um if I had forgotten, which I probably wouldn't not for vacation, but you if I would have forgotten good. my stuff. Would I have left you? Yes. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I, it's hard for me. Really? Yeah. If it was somebody else, <laughs> I'd be like, hey, so just call me and let me know how it goes. Fly out there. Yeah, I'll you meet can. you and then just get on the but boat when you can. I don't know. I would, I would have to get past the phase of being mad at you for forgetting. Because you probably have asked me like four or five times, and I, I got it, I got did it, I got check. it. Right, did you, did you, you check? check? Right. You probably I, I bring it over two days ahead of time. I'll put it all I would have put it all put together. Leave. <laughs> you and O will be I like, did. we got Kim's, we got <laughs> ours, we got this, we got, we're good. We got he everybody. That, but I learned that from him when I, I traveled to Utah um, without him. And I was like, okay, I need this, I need that. And I'm like, this is what O goes through, the whole family. Mm-hmm. He, he gathers all of our passports, he gathers everything, and has yeah. it all in one place. Yeah, it's very like, nice. On the cruise, though, I kept I kept it because he was just so anxious. I was like, I need you to relax now. We're we're good. It's it's fine. We made it. We made it. Right. We so, made it on the boat yeah, together. Yeah. No, it's tough. I mean, we forget stuff all the time. I know I do. Like I forgot. So Flip you flops. would you would probably leave me. Like, let's just go. let's just really be honest with everybody. You would probably leave me and just tell me, just meet us at the next stop, and then fly back, and then and then cruise back. Yeah, maybe. Because my, my my cabin's still there. True. Right? Right. So. Mm. Mm. I don't know. Would you leave me? Nah. I'll be like, all right, cool. What are we doing? I'm, <laughs> like, I'm so like, oh, wow. All right, well. Hmm. I guess we'll fly. We'll, we can, and I'll but ask it's questions. It's different, but it's me and O. Like, I would have been like, so far, are we staying? Because you ain't going by yourself. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so you know what I mean with you just yeah. you yeah but with me I have to think about both of us yeah that's true so it's because we're like a trio so like, yeah I would no, tell you guys no you guys go don't worry about me I'm the one who messed up here don't worry have a great time see you and over you know, there your new season I'm afraid of what you're gonna do 
Well, yeah. 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 So, yes. So, so we'd be like, you know what? Can we get a refund? <laughs> Cruise was, yeah, Cruise was different. Um, I just, I'm just surprised by all the stuff that's happening now. Like, I just. There's I, a lot of stuff going on. I just don't understand it. It's so hard for me to understand. And again, not to be judgmental, but it's something I, I just feel like as adults, we make our decisions and we, whatever you want to do, that's your decision. But I don't know. The kids should have some type of guidance and influence um, to say, okay, so this is our core belief. Mm -hmm. And then you decide when you get older. I was just so surprised to see the moms singing the songs with their kids twerking and dancing yeah there were absolutely i can't twerk around dylan dylan would be like what what is happening stop, stop moving why like, you? yeah but but that's what i'm saying is mm -hmm. but they weren't they make their own decision when they get older you know what i mean right like, right just, right i feel like the minute they see us co-signing that behavior yes it's, just, it's fine for them yeah um, i, I think that's that. why they do it but see this is the generation that we live in right they're and seeing those songs sad. on other sad, platforms. It makes me so sad. And I posted this the other day, and I don't know if you saw it. We need more workers to harvest our word. We, we're not doing enough. Absolutely. I feel like there are so many different people that have so many different de beliefs, and they are so loud. Yeah. And it's almost, no pun intended, trumping our voice. You, you, you didn't want to use that word. <laughs> I just felt like... <laughs> Don't Is he in jail? Like, what? what? That's what I'm saying. I see what I'm saying. I would have left him. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> he would I would have been like, catch us on the next one, all right? Me and T you going in. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, okay. <laughs> if O would have left his stuff, me and you would have been like, I right. okay. We're out. We're you right. probably would have been like, Papa, it's all right. You <laughs> I think I think Trump just needed a, a genuine advisor. If he would have, he like, stay in jail. If he would have had a real deal, holy field like us. Oh yeah. If he would have, you know, hood therapist. That's what I'm saying. He would be different. He would be different, but he did like a different type of hood. Yeah. Well, he's not from around here. He was. No, no, no. But he did like some. I don't care. I'm gonna do it my he way. He put it in the hood. No, he, no, he sure did. From the <laughs> he sure did. He said, "Guys, guys, what what y'all do out here? Do this over here, okay? Okay. Thank you very much." <laughs> <laughs> so, but anyway, I just feel like we have to be louder in our stance and our beliefs, and we're not. Now we're so scared. Yeah. We're scared of saying how we feel. And listen, freedom of speech. They're allowed to feel how they feel. I'm allowed to feel how I feel. Mm -hmm. Don't get mad at me if I feel different. Right. You know what I mean? Respect. Like, you want, like right. let's just have e enough respect for each other. I feel like, if we look at each other too much as our sexuality yeah. and who we sleep with, and we don't look at each other as humans. No. I just need to look at you as a human being. That's anything it. Anything else is nothing. It's None. Just you and him. That's if, yeah. If you even believe in him. Right. And if you don't. That's that's on you. Again, that is on you. Mm -hmm. But if I look at you as a human and you're, you're a great person and we can have good conversation or whatever, yeah. I don't I don't need to know anything else you do. True. I don't that care. That bothers me. Yeah, that bothers me. So a lot of times we're just scared. We're scared to, to do this and scared to say this and it's just not right. It's not right. Like, your voice shouldn't overpower mine. I mean, I'm just scared to tell you, like, my season stuff. You know what I'm saying? But you're scared because you know it's for a good thing. Oh, that's right. Right? I, I haven't really done anything. I'm just <laughs> messing around I know. Right now. Sometimes you be going ghost. I'm like, hmm. I think about you. I'm like, she's quiet. When you're quiet. You think I'm doing bad stuff? Not not bad stuff. <laughs> But you, you know, you stepping in different arenas, touching different waters. I'm, a, I'm know, like, I'm the little. Uh, Tiptoeing. <laughs> you be like, eh, maybe not. Eh. I, I, I low key, I know that, and I, my spirit tells me that. You know, it's, but it's so funny. There's times You're that stuttering. you tell me it's that. Fine. No, no. <laughs> you know, I just no, but but what? what uh, and then you went, and then you went. But you wait a minute. Remember, you do want to look wait, at me. Like, wait, wait a minute. Let me just explain. Let me explain. Shout out to Dixie Cream and Windermere because they really house us all the time. Really? They house us. They, Dixie Cream doesn't like. Oh, yeah, they do. They don't house us and listening they to our do. stories. We're there for hours talking. Yeah, that's true. They see us. They're like, oh, we're going to put you in the back. Hmm? It's double mimosas. Double mimosas. They see us. They're like, pineapple, orange. What are you going to have? Because you might change your mind. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do? <laughs> no, 
No, they're like, great. No, they're, they're awesome. They're awesome. They like, uh, we like to go there every Sunday. Mm-hmm. Um, so shout out to Dixie Cream yes. in Winter Garden. Is it Winter Garden? No, Windermere. Windermere. Don't get it twisted. Don't, Don't get it twisted. Mm-hmm. But you know, you're not going to be able to go this Sunday because where are you going? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Did I not share with everyone? <laughs> I will be going to Maui. Hawaii. Hawaii. <laughs> Aloha. Where does my cousin live in Hawaii? I, maybe. Maybe. Really? I heard there's like little propeller planes that go to different yeah, islands. Yes, absolutely. You have yeah. the big island, then you have the little islands. Absolutely. Yeah, so they said that Maui is like the best, but it's the richest and the most expensive. I don't care. What are you going there for? Work. Okay, so what does that mean? Oh, <laughs> Sorry, I was like so recruiting? caught up that I was going to be. <laughs> is there a conference? <laughs> no, um, me and my, the owner of my company and one of my oh. coaches, we're doing, we're revamping our education um, curriculum. So we have to like look at the old one, break it down and revamp it so and, they can and, go active. And you have to do that in Hawaii? Yes. You couldn't do that here? Zoom only allows you 45 minutes sometimes. <laughs> They don't, wait a minute. No, we have Why? unlimited. Mom, we have unlimited, but it's a lot. It's a lot. We have to use in. like whiteboards and blackboards and a lot of boards. Mm. <laughs> we have to go into the ocean. You know, That's like we got to like get that zen moment. And it's so crazy because Monday, I only have to work half a day. Um, But actually, I'm only working for because I, my office is here in the East Coast. So I'm only going to be working from 5 to like 12. Over there in Hawaii, <laughs> and then oh, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna be done <laughs> by twelve o'clock. Well, remember before the podcast done. started, we talked about what content to post. Yeah, yeah. I'm not saying you have to listen to what I'm saying. I'm saying like, let's give me some more content. Oh, not just it would be really nice on Monday, <laughs> and then Friday. Um, I don't work on Friday. Yeah. I'm off on Friday, and I don't leave so until how Friday long evening. Are you gonna be out there? Um, from Sunday to Friday. But I won't get here because they're five hours ahead. So it's six. It's five. Five and, and it's behind. Right. So I'll be leaving Hawaii at like 10 p.m. Mm. So I won't get here. I happened to watch when we went to Paris. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's right. You went to Paris. You had yourself a Tyler. Yeah. Well, or a Brad. I'm just joking. Yeah. People. Like, I'm sure there are people that are well off that are, you know, have other needs. <laughs> She's just, it's, those it's are just a joke. It's just, yeah, a joke. it's just an yeah. inside joke. Yeah. But yeah, um, yeah, so I'll be back by Saturday evening. Like, well, Saturday early evening and stuff. And then Saturday, okay. <clears throat> Sunday, I'll be able to come back so we can do our podcast. Because, you know, I'm Sunday. fired. Sunday. Oh, did I tell you that I got my mom to serve? She's serving with me the 15th. <laughs> <laughs> So, so Your mom? Well, our church does serve Hold day. Up. <laughs> they do it twice a year, and our pastors are very adamant um, about serving the community. And mm-hmm. you know, faith without works is dead. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, we do gas buy down. Yep. So July fifteenth, Hope Winter Garden will be doing gas buy down. We do Habitat for Humanity, where we help build homes for people. Mm-hmm. It, it's just great. We but make anyway, beds for kids. Um, yes. We don't have any um, beds. Yeah. Yep, absolutely. And so. This particular community outreach Mm -hmm. thing is we're going to uh, make flower bouquets and then we're going to deliver the flowers and Bibles to nursing homes in our area. Oh, how nice. And And mom's going to do that with you? That, you know what? Good job. Good job. That, that was a lot of work. Well, she has a special place in her heart for elderly people, mm-hmm. as I do too. But with taking care of my grandmother, she just she knows nursing homes, she knows the system. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And so when I asked her, she said, "Absolutely." I I was waiting. I had to scroll in to make sure it wasn't absolutely not. And I was just like, <laughs> doing that to on my Android. Message. You were able to do that on Android because I know on the first of all, I could do Android. a lot in Android. Okay, um, your Apple didn't, or your iPhone didn't tell you when threads came. Didn't even tell you about Meta. Took my own Mega. I'm on Mega. Okay, 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 Mega. Okay, okay, Mega. That's what I was saying. What? I don't even go on Facebook. You know why I don't go on Facebook? Because somebody told me Uh-oh. a long time ago, like a few months ago, maybe like a year ago. A long time. Maybe a year ago. Um, Facebook's for old people. And I was oh, like. Yeah. The kids told me that too. 
I was like, you know what, screw ya. But well, it just so happened. Was originally created for college students. So and then we took over, and then we didn't know. But I was the college student that joined Facebook because it was MySpace and Facebook. Yeah, we had MySpace. We had AOL. We went down yeah. to MySpace. Ooh. Then we went to Facebook. Right. Then Instagram. Then then Twitter. Don't forget Napster with the music. The Napster. Stop putting dog for everything. Mm. That's what my grandma used to do. The the publi, <laughs> the fable. Yo, stop saying the, please. The COVID. What's the COVID? What are we doing? Sorry. Yo, Sorry. I, I went there. I went there. I felt like the Facebook mega. You know what I mean? Like, why did they mega. change their name? It's why did they change their name? Why? 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 Facebook was it? He has, I'm sure, Senor, is Senor, it Senor Zuckerberg. <laughs> El Senor Zuckerberg. Tiene <laughs> razón. He has reason. You know, we don't know what it is. But well, you did bilingual. I don't yeah. even think Facebook no, uh, does I bilingual think, anymore. I think Elon Musk is actually suing wow. Mark Zuckerberg for threads because it's very similar to Twitter. And all the all the memes on there are um, you know, the little Twitter bird. So cute. He's he's dead. You know, with the X's on the eyes and it's just Get so out. Bad. It is, yeah. I've never been on Twitter. Sure. I'm not a Twitter person. No, I'm what? Not, ever. That's not for me. I was on Twitter for a little bit. I put our stuff on Twitter. You have your own Twitter and Instagram now. The brup, 60 characters. You have to, we waited on the line for a very long time. Then we took a, like a Disney, one of those Disney little trams over to the beach. And we did, we did pay for a, um, an excursion to one of the resorts. How was that I'm resort? Gonna be honest, I, it was a little disappointing, that part. Um, be, like, like I said, being with the people that I was with made it better. But yeah. I just... It just didn't feel right. The a burger was like twenty dollars plus no. plus twenty percent service fee. What? That did not include VAT tax. It was just I feel like they just So they you could have barbecued on yourself? Like you would have found somebody like and got just, your own. They saw barbecue. that we were coming and they just overpriced everything. Oh <gasps> horrible. Like so it wasn't included? No. When that's, you get off the boat, whatever you do off the boat has nothing to do with carnival. That's crazy. So it's just not, yeah. If peop, people are like, oh, would you go back? No, I would not go back there. That resort they was not all that they great? They weren't that great. They weren't that nice. You know, not what I expected from right, right. Mini Bahamas, you know. And again, mm. it, maybe it was just that one spot, mm. but that's all I can go off of is that one spot, so. I went on a cruise and they had me go on like this fast boat in the ocean, right? Yes. right? They, and then they, they, they take you to this island mm -hmm. and it was like free food, free drinks. And I was like, bet. Got there. There was iguanas everywhere. There were military men with machine guns. Um, I guess that was security. Yeah, it was in, in Cozumel. Nice. And then we there was no place to be like on the beach you had to bring a towel they didn't tell us that then there was bees everywhere mm. and so i went back when we got back on the cruise i said i want my money back because first of all i'm allergic to bees okay <laughs> i don't even know if i am but f it because if i would have got stung by a bee and i didn't have an epic pen an epi pen that would have been your first bill because really? Because I don't even know if I'm allergic to bees. Oh, you just used it to get a refund? I mean, the food had bees in it. It wasn't, they were going like this, like it was a fly. Hmm. It's okay. It's okay. We did have a lot of flies in memory. I had to like take what? a bite and close it. And then I opened it I, and I closed it. I closed it real quick. It was, yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't a great experience, but the mm. island's beautiful. Um, really? We, we looked at a lot of real estate there. It was mm -hmm. beautiful. It just it wasn't my destination place. So. Oh no, I'm so sad. No, but I'm so yeah. sad for you. I'm trying to think. We haven't recorded in such a long time. We haven't really talked about it. So I think yeah, that over, over the time that we were On lifing. Vacation? Oh, lifing. That's what we're gonna call it. That's right. I see a lot of people on their podcast, and they're they're very vulnerable, and they talk about everything. I mean, everything. We don't do that. Do you like think we, we talk should? about topics, but I mean, I talk about everything. I'm not. I'm no, an but open like they're, book. If they're like, if they feel like crying and they're talking about something, they talk about it, and then they like record themselves. 
And it's crazy the amount of views they get, which I'm not all about views at this point, but I'm like, at the same time, I'm like, do I want to be that That's vulnerable? because their camera is their mirror. Remember I told you about this? We talked about this in the beginning. People like to cry in front of the mirror because they like to see what their the faces. I guess people were like, nah, bro. It was very low. It was a like, lot of people do cry in front of a mirror. And they cry in front of their camera because they want to see. And they record themselves and then they send it to somebody. But here's the thing. They get crazy views. And so that makes them. Because people are crazy and they like That makes crazy. them feel like, oh, this is great. People like it. So let me do more of it. Mm. So you're telling me I need to be more emotional? No. <laughs> Not at all. I mean, I'm the you less know, I'm emotional. in a different season. I can tell you about some stuff no, that's I'm, happening. I'm the less emotional. But let's not say emotional. I would say um, I'm the lesser of us when it comes to vulnerability. Yes, you are. However, I think we both share certain things. Like when we're passionate about something, I think we get emotional about it. I but I can't know. just, I don't, I don't cry in the mirror anymore because I have no reason to. Good job. I want to do the, you know what I mean? Like to put that like period on it. Okay. Like, okay. I don't cry. <laughs> Why? Why? You don't no, cry? I try not to cry. Now, Tell me. I was watching a movie mm. and it was a love story. And did I ugly cry? And I have a big mirror in my room. <laughs> And I looked over into the mirror. <laughs> did you laugh when you when you saw? Did your did your cry turn into a laugh when you were like, "I'm crying in the mirror again"? <laughs> I did, but it was more like, "What the hell? Why am I crying?" <laughs> it was a Netflix like love story. It was about um, Queen Charlotte. Shout out! Like they did a phenomenal job. It's, oh, I um, didn't finish watching it. I only started. Did you see um Bridgerton? Of course. Oh my god. Season three is coming out. But, um, okay, mama. <laughs> boo boo. <laughs> you got to catch on, guys. Catch on. Um, but <laughs> Queen oh, Charlotte, yeah. it's only like six episodes. Oh, the, oh really? Okay, yeah. I only saw like the first one. Oh, my God. I was like, the, the last one. Really? <laughs> ugly cry. I'm talking about ugly cry. And then it caught me off guard because I was folding clothes and stuff. You know, like you're doing stuff. <laughs> And you're watching TV, so you're like paying attention. I'm clothes. My vulnerability is mad, mad low right now. Like, I don't know. No My guard is down. Yeah. My guard is down. And then, like, I'm folding clothes, and then, like, I'm watching my TV, and I'm just like, like, in a daze. And then, like, the love story of her and King and the King, and I was like, oh my God, I want that love. I want to be like that. And then it was like, <laughs> it was a hard cry. It was like a, it was like, <laughs> like, shut up. I'm talking about washcloth type of. I think of, you were crying. There was more of, that you were was crying it? about. I don't know. I don't mind I being. You crying about. Actually, I'm happy that I cried by myself. Like nobody was in the room to there's be like, babe, are you okay? No, there's nothing crying, but crying like a. I hate when people, like if you see me watching a movie, because my kids do this too. But they're like, Mom, what's wrong? What happened? You're crying like that for a movie? And I'm like, do you get scared when you watch a scary movie? Okay, so I'm getting emotional when I'm watching a little bit of drama about a love story. But I'm talking about ugly. Do you still watch those reality shows? You know what's so crazy? No. Why? Because you live in your own reality show? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Wow, that was good. <laughs> that was good. That was good. You know, AKA, I got my own. AKA I got season. my. <laughs> I got my own. You know, players in here. <laughs> I got different Ponies characters. Ponies loving hip hop. There's love and Kim. <laughs> love and Kim. <gasps> Maybe we should make that like. We don't be making this fresh, <laughs> Bobo. That's a that's I a thought you was in Paris, bro. <laughs> with the we. I, <laughs> I was just trying to incorporate we because you trilingual and everything. You know what I'm saying? I am a little trilingual. <laughs> okay. I'm trilingual. You know what I'm saying? So no. I'm hood lingual, right? <laughs> My thing is a little bit hood lingual, okay? So I was just trying to say, like, maybe we should do that. 
maybe no but when i say love and hip-hop i don't mean i mean loving kim i don't mean love and kim i mean loving kim yeah loving oh my like, like a bachelor girl i don't oh, know oh my god tea right. tea instead of roses <gasps> what's the flower oh my god <laughs> daisies do you think somebody can like i don't know i don't know. i don't think i'm a lot i'm glad you admitted that though that was that's a good that's good I'm a lot. I know. But I'm a fun loving. Like, right. I just listen. I was in a committed relationship for 23 years. I changed who I was. You Seriously. Con- you conformed to whoever you were with. Right. And so. No names. No, no names. I mean, if you look. They try to let them look on their own. <laughs> okay. However. You can't. Turn for yourself. <laughs> He's having a good time. Just He's like, you know what? This is good. But for me. Now it's just like, listen, this is who I am. I like to have fun. I like to have a good time. I don't like the stress. I don't like the drama. Don't if you have girls that you're dealing with, then just don't date me. You know what I mean? Like right. unless you're dating me with a purpose, mm. cool. If you're not dating me with a purpose, are you dating with a purpose though? I am. Okay. I like. I like. Listen, I like being home. I like. I want. I want to travel with you and all. I want somebody to watch Queen Charlotte. Me too. I want to be like, babe, babe, babe. You see that? Babe. That's us. That's us. Like, I want to do that. I want I want them to be like, why am I watching this shit? <laughs> Excuse my language. Like, why? Why? Mm. And I want them to be like, because I love her. Like, I love, I love being in a com- committed relationship. I love being that person with, you know, who I get to have a good time with and just, like, go places and not feel ashamed okay. with that person like because they know how to carry themselves mm. and I don't feel like I have to babysit. Does that make sense? So it sounds to me like your past relationship, that's what you're feeling. You're feeling those are the things you learn, right? So when I, mm-hmm. my children, they're older, they're adult children. Adulting? <clears throat> they are adulting. Ah, that's been crazy. Anybody, shout out to the parents that are parenting adult children. Mm-hmm. You've done a you have a 16 year old, but man, these adult kids, it's just a whole different one just moved out. I don't even know how to act right now. It's just a whole different <laughs> yeah. way of being when mm-hmm. you have to parent adult yeah. children, right? Yeah. But parent is parenting is relative. So mm-hmm. it's not like they're dictating. Right. Parenting. I mean, I kind of um, parenting could be supportive, parenting could just be a good listener, whatever. But anyway. When you leave a relationship, I always mm-hmm. ask them, because they've all been through heartache, mm-hmm. what did you get from that relationship, and what will you do different for your next one? Yeah. What will you do different for your next one? Be myself. And be, I know I'm a good-hearted person. Mm-hmm. I know that I can give you the best love and experience and journey. You know what I mean? Like, I think life is just a journey, and I just want to have mm-hmm. fun with it. Okay. Um, but it's not always fun and games. No, it's not. But I want to learn, and I just want us to push each other to be better than what we were. So that's what you learned from your past yes. relationship. Okay. Yeah. To push I each learned. other. And push to each learn. other, okay. right. And then not just be me. Like, I want someone to help lead me. You know what I mean? Um, but that, that may be, now be careful what you ask for, because. Mm-hmm. Oh, you mean I got to be submissive? Yes. The word submissive. There are times where you're going to have to be submissive. Yeah. And well, submissive, a lot of people misconstrue that as weakness. Yes. That's not weakness. It's submitting at that moment saying, lead me. Right? Because mm-hmm. if you think about it, we submit. We are supposed to submit. Exactly. And be obedient to God all the time. All the time. Because we're supposed to allow him to lead us. Yeah. And so there's nothing wrong with the right person mm-hmm. leading us. So Exactly. You but it has to be the right to person to lead me. Which means you should date, you know, not being messy and. I had, I had, I had this on site. Good. Oh, Good but shit. he's in emergency. That's why. Just question. But anyway, like for me, yeah, I'm dating with a purpose. I am dating with intention mm. um, of finding that person to just elevate me to something different. I don't want to be the person that's always pushing someone else. Like, yeah. I want someone to push me too. Not just support me. You know what I mean? Like, there's this a difference. I think some relationships that you have, um, and this is just my opinion, so don't come crucifying me, but my opinion is that some people, they're there, like, to just support you and just be your cheerleader, cheerleader mm-hmm. but they're not giving you substance to be better. Mm-hmm. Right? Fact. And so, for me... Of, you have a lot of cheerleaders. 
I have cheerleaders, but I do feel that I've eliminated cheerleaders that were just rah, rah, rah. Good job, Cam. Mm -hmm. Yay, yay. Good job. Yeah. I see now that I have cheerleaders, it's more like. That's growth. Yeah. I see the, the cheerleaders that I have around me as just like. I want I want you to find like somebody like you need that you're a powerful woman you're you're this you're that like you're gonna find that person you know what I mean like oh what he say mm, don't deal with that like <laughs> you know what I mean but I'm just like right it's just more like I'm I'm starting to see like you know what no like not do I mind going on a dinner date and having a drink and stuff like that hey I'm okay because I'm cool like that you know what I mean I'm cool like that I'm cool That's like cool. that. <laughs> that was a black song, by the way. That was right. It was we like a just have chill little sound bites like that. Like yeah, because you know we all about that. Yeah. But anyway, so I think right now is just probably I need to put that on my bio. If nobody gives me a nice clever bio, it's more like with purpose. You know what I mean? On everything I do, just to elevate myself. I want someone to just like educate me, teach me. Like, and I think that's the open for it because you've. You've led for a few decades, mm -hmm. and leading, we tend to just it's lead. It's a natural instinct to just lead. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So to be in a relationship, to know, okay, I need to succumb to them trying to lead me. Yeah. Now, you don't want to succumb to just anybody leading you. But what yeah. I'm saying is that you have to identify that and go, okay, okay, this makes sense. I could try to. Is it? Out. Is it? I had to learn that. You had to learn that. I was oh. going to ask you. Yeah. Always eating chips. I don't know. What do you feel like? <laughs> yeah, you can hear that, by the way. Yeah. yeah um, was it hard for you to learn that? Or was it okay for you? Extremely difficult. Really? Very much so. Hmm. I was a single mom. Yeah. With two. Um, anybody that came around me, you were a squirrel in my world trying to get a nut. Mm hmm You know, this, it was, I had walls i was guarded um yeah. and i also unfortunately i was also brought up in the mentality of you know all men are dogs They're yeah all cheat this is what they do right and also unfortunately every man that i loved in my life family wise they all cheated i stepped mm -hmm. and so that's all i knew yeah and so i went into relationships with that as well yeah so in my mind it was like um I'm going to stay right here, and I won't let you get close enough to hurt me. So meeting O and being friends with O was just different because it was like, okay, so I have to, okay, yeah, I got to do this. Okay, I have to listen to this. And and then I got to the point where I'm like, okay, I have to change at some yeah. point. I have to listen. But, I, but my spirit told me I should listen. It wasn't like run. Mm. And That's we all difference. had that. Yeah. You know what I mean, we all had that 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 pull as a run never yeah. had that i think in the season now that i think me going and it's something i want to brought up, bring up too is that i hate being told you're the right girl but not for me just not for me and i'm like but you wasn't right for me at all <laughs> like, yeah no. you know what i mean like uh, uh but i'm a good girl you're like you're a great girl like somebody's gonna snatch you mm-hmm yeah yeah. Whenever God's, you know, ready for me, you know, like whoever puts in, he puts but, in my life. But don't, don't take that negative That's not a reflection of you. Yeah. That's a reflection at times, because mm. this is where you have to do that self-reflection, right? Yeah. So don't cry in the mirror, but look in the mirror. Mm. That right there is also saying they may not be in the season of being ready. Right. Right? So don't put that on you immediately. Yeah. At all. Yeah. That's not, if they're not ready... That's fine. Yeah. Oh, you're then, so great. Love you to death. Bye. Yeah. That's don't, that's don't do that to yourself. Yeah. Right. It yeah. could be one hundred percent them, mm -hmm. but it could also be like, okay, what is it that you're doing? So, I started realizing, okay, I have two children. I'm 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 a single mom. I'm the common factor here. Mm -hmm. So, what am I doing wrong? Okay. Or what do I need to change? Okay. That's when I started going. Okay, I need to be more submissive, mm -hmm. in a sense of. It's okay to have a partner lead you at times. Yeah. You don't always have to be this strong, overpowering person that has to dictate everything because that's what I was used to. Yeah. So I knew I had to change that. 
Mm. Right. And then that's what I think helped me have a longer lasting. None of my relationships really lasted more than four years. And now we're on 20. Woo, woo. Where's the. Woo, woo, woo. Aye, aye, aye. Sound bites. We need new sound bites. <laughs> we need to work on the stuff. What, what was the sound bite? I don't have the headphones. Oh, you don't have the headphones? It's right there. Oh, shoot. No, it well, was a boo, boo, boo. And then. Nothing. Okay. It was you. Okay. All right, moving on. Okay. Um, but yeah, so I think because I think when I tell women, when I have had conversations with women, I was like, you know, it's okay to be submissive. They're like, <laughs> it's it's like it immediately triggers. Like I don't have to submit to nobody. It's like it's just when I say submit, I'm mean, like communicate how you feel, be vulnerable with your partner, and be the open thing to is listen. Though, sis, hmm? The people that are out here in these streets, yeah, they not ready for that. No, but or they're they're playing so many yeah, different games. You, me, are you ready to submit? I would love to submit. You sure? Yeah. Mm, I don't think you. I think I like being checked. What? Mm. <laughs> you like being checked for the moment because you think it's sexy. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me what to do. Not in that way. You do. No. 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 I no. meant like, oh, it's like, oh, he's showing oh. strength. But if it carries on into. Your everyday life, <laughs> I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna like, cut you. I'm gonna cut you. I'm gonna cut you. Do you see what I'm saying? No, and but I to be honest, I know it's funny. That. I'm laughing. I'm laughing. I know it's fine. You laugh it's when funny. you're, you it's laugh funny. When you're yeah, nervous. You're okay. No, no, no. But seriously, on, on all seriousness, I want to be led. Hmm. I want to be led correctly. Because for a while, there was a time that I was submissive for a long time. To, no, I'm serious. Why didn't you choose to miss it? Uh, because it was a lot. <laughs> it was a lot. I did a lot. Mm. You saw me. I tried to be submissive, mm. but it was just like when I would want to be led, I was being led down a hole. And I knew that that's not the hole I was supposed to go down. Did you know? I think so, yeah. Did you have like a, tug, a gut, a yes. spiritual? So which, I call it the Jesus tug. Yeah, I think. He's talking at you, but you didn't listen. Yeah, and so I would go down a hole, and then I'd be like, "Oh, this is this is not the way I was supposed to go." Mm. Like I knew it, mm. and so that would be where I would change it up right. and be a leader more and than also other factors that are playing. Right? Of course, and the kids and the family. And of course. So then you 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 want to be submissive because that's what you feel like you're supposed to do as a wife and as a Christian woman, and you know, um, submit to your husband. As he submits to Jesus. Yes. There's no submitting to them and they're abusive. But of course. And submitting to them and they're, you know, cheating. But at that like time, not... I wasn't educated enough to okay. know. I was the thinking of okay. being submissive of just letting my husband lead wherever that goes, mm. right? Because that's, he's supposed to be my leader. He's supposed to be the person, mm. right? But then when I started to see that I was going down holes that I wasn't supposed to be going down, mm. it made me end up being more of a like, no, like, mm-mm. That's not what it is. Mm. We're going to do it this way. I'm going to do it this way then. Mm. Like, you either catch on to my ride or don't. So that's what happened. And I think now, after everything that I've learned, everything that I have has changed my mind and my view of things and me having a different relationship with God than I did back then, I'm in a different season. Yes. Do I wild out a little bit? Maybe. You know, I try to be very cautious of what I do. Um, but to be honest, like I would love to find someone that wants to lead me the right way. In order for you to do that, Mm -hmm. you have to love God. Absolutely. You cannot date anyone. And I'm not speaking for our audience because Mm -hmm. there are some people that may listen to us and watch us that don't believe in God. Yeah. Right. And Mm -hmm. that's on them. But I'm talking to Kim. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And if you want someone to lead you, they have to love God more than you. Right. And be truthful to that. Right. Nothing. Don't be lying. Because you be know going what? to church and then, you know, lighten don't it be... up after. <laughs> I mean, I don't, I mean, listen, whatever what y'all do what is what you do. However, don't be telling me you went to Sunday church with me right. and the first thing you want to do is be like, I'm being the car blazing. Mm-hmm. No, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. Yeah. Or, or go to church. Or, yeah. or go to church and be honest. Have done that. Go to church and be honest, mm-hmm. right? 
Let's hang out with the family. Honestly, it's hard for people, though. Is It is. You're let's right. Be, let, let's be honest. No let's be honest. honest. It's let's not honest. easy. There are people that are, it's so hard for them to be honest. They feel they'll be judged. Mm-hmm. They feel like they'll be chastised. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, just, they may lose their position in life. Yeah. In whatever position they hold. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. In whatever aspect they live. Yeah. They'll feel like, wait, if I'm too honest, it's not good. Which is why I go back to what we talked about. Harvesting and having our workers saying, I love God and this is how I, this is what I feel. Da, 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 da. We don't have enough of that because we're silent. Mm-hmm. But a lot of people are afraid to be right. honest. Yeah. And, and that, that goes, uh, I mean, that's and that's hard. like even the dumbest things to be honest about. What do you mean? Like, like if you're talking to someone else, I don't have to ask you 50,000 questions in three different ways. Right. Are you seeing someone else? You know what I'm saying? Like, just be mm-hmm. honest. We're like, hey, I'm dating you. I'm, I am dating someone else. You know, however, like, I like where this is going. Right. Cool. The competition's going to be, you know, out the park. <laughs> if you really want to know, don't <laughs> let me. <laughs> You know what I mean? No, I you know. I know. But I think it's just being honest about the dumbest things mm-hmm. that people are so afraid of because of past relationships or whatever the case is. But I also think that's some, not all, how they grew up. Well. They grew up just, don't talk about it. Don't be honest about it. Because one lie covers another lie covers another but lie. But the more you lie. lie. Yeah. Or, or he, n- another thing, too, that I don't like is the ghosting. How you can talk to me every single day, then all of a sudden you don't. Then when you call me, me a little Instagram sissy character. Mm, I said we might as well be pen pals. Mm-hmm. I feel like you in jail. Mm-hmm. If you just want me to brighten up your day, boo, with words, I could do that all day. Mm. It's for free. I'll do it for free. Mm. But will I? I'm gonna stop after a while because I'm tired. Because I need to find another pen pal. I don't know. So with that, because I I think I'm familiar mm. with the situation ish mm. ish. And ish. I say ish because it's you a lot. Tell me everything. I tell you the That's way. Fine. Only time enough, especially with certain people. But Do we like? Are you looking for something? So they're ghosting consistency, you. right? No, you are. Which means your behavior showing. I want to be consistent. Yes. So you're doing this, right? And then they're like, too much. This and this, but you're like, hey, hey, what's up? Hey, mm-hmm. and you're not begging or anything. You no, you're just looking for a consistent communication. You guys are starting to do this. The parallel, right? You were at one point, and then you're not. So I'd rather you be now, honest and be like, listen. Could they be more mature and say, hey, listen, this is not for me. And I feel like, you know, we're communicating a little too much. Absolutely. They should. But cool. Could it be a reflection of you looking for too much? True. Or you could just be honest and be like, listen, you know, like, I just want to be your friend right now. Whatever, whatever. Cool. Yeah. Don't be mad when you drop this dime <laughs> or dollar, dollar. bill yeah. <laughs> and someone else picks it up. And gives me what I want. I think, too, a lot of people like to do breadcrumbs. Mm. That I'm going to just drop this little seed that gives her enough and keeps her happy. But nah. You have to eat the crap. I'm not eating crap. I'm like this. Consistency is key to the, <laughs> the riddle. The riddle. It's behind my eyeball. <laughs> the riddle. The riddle. Ooh, ooh. The, the riddle. The riddle. Go ahead. Okay. Oh, okay. Go ahead. Just let me digress. That's okay. That's fine. But you know, I'm in a different season. I'm no longer dating, and I have right for twenty. Is dating sucks? This thing sucks. Does it? So dating sucks. Sucks. Mm. Sucks. I have more fun being a pen pal. So I know more single people than I know married people. Why does dating suck? Because people who were married or in a long term relationship are now single, Mm -hmm. and now they want to play this field. Like, oh, I could get that baddie. I can give her a breadcrumb and she'll still be there. Mm. Mm. See, I'm old school. So you give me a breadcrumb, I might eat one. I might. I might go. I might just go. Yeah. Right. Bye. But when you call me, I'll be like, hey, like nothing wrong. So your mind is like thinking, is she still into me? You don't know. 
Okay, but in general, because we're all playing this damn game. Right, right. That's I'm the thing. Say, we're all playing this what damn game. What's happening in the dating world? I Everybody's think. playing a game. It's a jigsaw puzzle, and everybody's trying to find a piece, mm -hmm. and everybody finds that right piece that fits in the slot. Great. Mm. Like, I mean, I'm just tired. Like, I'm just like, come on. Like, just be honest. Like, listen, you're not into me? Cool. Bet. I see you when I see you. Cool. Oh, you want to have brunch one day? Sure. No problem. We can catch up. Well, tell me your horror stories. I'll tell you mine. Because that's the friends that we could be. I'm that type of chick. Are you good, though? Be honest. Yeah. Are you? And I went through seasons of not... Doing a good job of this. Mm -hmm. Are you good at reading signals? Are you good at? I think I am listening to the pull. I think I am, mm. but I also don't? like to give chances mm. because I'm hoping that somebody will be honest, especially when I'm very honest about being honest. Like, I tell you my story, I tell you my situation. You know what I mean? Like. But I am out here, like I'm actually looking for that. Like I'm, I'm done with that. Like I'm not even See, gonna go back. My guard comes up. That's when my guard comes up. I'm gonna give you what you give me. So I'm starting to be like that now. Mm. But th this is why all my friends, including yeah. you, yeah, you're so this, Tanya. You're so guarded. You're so. I went through so much hurt. I'm like, I'm not gonna give you more than what you're giving me. Yeah, and I, and I've actually that. said that. I've actually put that as one of my riddles. I'm going to give you the same energy you give me. Or I'm going to understand. Or less. Oh, listen. <laughs> one of my other ones was good. I like this one. I like this one. Well, You're going to like it, too. It said, <laughs> I'm going to understand, but I hope you understand when it comes to you. Meaning, uh, yeah, they, they're not because everybody wants to have that hold on somebody. Hmm. But also, like men, a just in case. Men, for the most part anatomically biologically they're just not built like us and so yeah. i think that women expect that from them you'll have your diamonds in the rough you'll have your few gems that are like oh my god let's watch you know bridgerton together and then you'll have ones that are like bro are you good it's different <laughs> but my whole point is like i think that our expectation like yeah the energy we're giving off we can't expect them to be like us. Mm. They're just not going to be like us. They they can sometimes understand just, what we're going here's through. Here's the thing. But I just want consistency. Like, if we are talking every day. I can consistently treat you like crap. But that, you're consistent. So that's my choice. No, no, no. Think about this. It's my choice to continue to deal with you because you deal with me. <laughs> that's our cue, that's I think, finish? That, that we need to finish. Oh, um, so I'll finish this up with. Or you could give us your opinion. Cause yeah. So my know. my thing is my the consistency. And if you're not consistent with me, then I'm going to lose interest. I'm going to still be that cool girl because I'm like that. Like, listen, I could chill with anybody. Mm. And you know I have, like, people that I shouldn't be hanging out with. But they're just my cool peoples. Absolutely. Yeah, but those are my cool peoples. And I love hanging out with them. I love just shooting the crap with them, whatever, whatever. But I know nothing's going to happen out of that. Because I know that I, it's honest. Like, they've been honest with me from the beginning. Get what I mean? Like, and I didn't want anything out of that. Mm. You know? So, that's just my, f I like. I used to be there. Yeah. I, listen, I can hang out with anyone. I like to, ha I'll have a good time with anyone. You, you know? I'm only asking because you said anybody. Mm. I'm mm. calling you out. I would. I you know why? I think you can. Mm. No, I could. I could. He would laugh. He would laugh and be like, this girl is too much. And I'm like, yep. I'll try to grab you by the... I know. I know you probably would. But I would I, definitely. I could hang out with anybody and have a blast. For me, I have a good time. What are you looking for when you do that? Just life. Having fun. Mm. No worries. You know what I mean? No stress. So Living in the moment. It helps you forget. Just being in the moment. Oh, um, okay. it's just living in the moment. Yeah. Okay. I get that. I get that. I'm not an in the moment person, but mm -hmm. I, I know what you mean by that. Yeah. yeah. I like to be in the moment. I like to just have a good time. Like when we were here at your birth at the birthday party for your cousin, like I took the, like <laughs> the fountain and started singing. Like that's just me. That was great. 
Yeah. I have so many videos of that, by the way. <laughs> Has <laughs> he hasn't posted them yet? Yeah, it's good. like I had a good time. You know what I mean? Like, and I'm spontaneous like that. Mm-hmm. But it's because I just want everybody to have a good time. Like, let's just live in this moment. Let's just have a good time in this That's moment. Agree. I wish I had more of that because I overthink things. Really? Yeah. You don't think so? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I just wanted to say it out loud. I overthink like, really. everything, <laughs> and so I'm like, should I be doing this? Should I? Uh, should I? Should I? Should I? Yeah, just live it. If Jesus was in the room with me, would I see that? Like, yeah, I, just, I don't. Different. I say Jesus put me in this moment for a reason. Mm, I don't. <laughs> That's why we're so opposite. <laughs> I'm looking at his. I don't, Jesus put me I here. I did that. I lived. I I was put in so many situations where I know that I shouldn't have been in. So now I ask myself, should I be here? Oh, yeah. I I think opposite. Like I think God put me here for a reason. So, and I, and I think I said this to you before on one of our other podcasts, is like, I want to leave an imprint on anybody I touch. Okay. Whether it's good, bad, in between, whatever it is. Like, I want them to be like, yo, she was, she was dope. Yeah. Like, she was cool. You know what I mean? Whether they liked me or they didn't, they thought I was too loud or too crazy or too spontaneous or too much or whatever the case is. So like, left an imprint. I just left the imprint. Right. They're going to always remember me. Why is that important to you? Because I feel like that was my calling. Mm-hmm. I feel like that is my purpose. Okay. Makes sense. Mm-hmm. And, and not everybody has the same calling, right? No. So I've had people come to me and I'm like, hmm, do I open my mouth or do, do I sit here and go, <laughs> right? <laughs> I don't co-sign everything. You know that. I'm yeah. not a co-signer. No. Especially for my stuff. A, you want me to be a soundboard or are you asking me for my opinion? Tell me what I need to. I think with me, it's like, I want you to be my soundboard. I know you're gonna tell me what you feel, but tell I, me at the end. End. No, fine. I try to. I've been good with that. No, you have. I know no, you're awesome. Going you're what? transitioning. You're transitioning what? into different seasons. Right. So I'm like. So I meet that one. You know my blinking. It's fine. Yeah. Just let me blink. <laughs> let me blink this out. Uh, <laughs> and then at night, you're part of my prayers. Like, <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Tanya and Jesus, for <laughs> helping me out on the back end. <laughs> but, I, but, I want, but I need friends like that to help me, too. Yes, of course. I always I pray for you. I struggle with so many different things. Because you struggle because you're such a soundboard for yeah. so many people. For sure. Right? And yeah. so because you are a light, and you know how you said this to me about me, but you are a light to so many people. Right. So it's it's a lot. It, it's very draining. It's weight-bearing. It is. And I think that that's why I pray for you because I, I want to give you strength yeah. to get I through that, that stuff yeah, for sure. because not everybody can handle that. But you handle it with very good grace and, and, and amazing, like, I mean, I you know. I just yell at O for it. And go no, back. poor O. No, <laughs> poor O has to see you I wake up like a... He sees it all. Like a jack-in-the-box, like, Hoo, I got to pray <laughs> for 15 minutes. <laughs> um, but, I mean, we're human, right? So, we're, yeah, we just... It's tough. It is. It is. It's tough. But it's I think tough. even if even for those that are not walking with God mm-hmm. in their heart, yeah, it's whichever it's, path they're walking. But in. it's still hard. It is. Life is just still hard. Yeah. From economy to family to loyalty, just every aspect of life, whether you're with or without Him, is still hard. For me, it's harder without Him because mm-hmm. having Him. Helps you. I get to lean on him more. Yeah. And I talk to him more. But um, I, there are people that talk to other things. Yeah. I, I I don't understand it, but if they had something and they don't, right? Right. So I think just life in general has become so hard. It is. It is. And yeah. it's a rough situation to yeah. be in and, and, and different seasons that you're in and everything like that. So Everybody's opposing each uh, other. This, Why are you crazy. doing that? Why are you wearing that? Why are you... What, why are you I, identifying as that? Yeah, da, 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 da. Like, it's just so that? much. And I was like, bro, it d- why are we? Living? I told my baby daddy that I identify as being invisible. <laughs> so stop calling me. <laughs> That's a TikTok. <laughs> Thanks, bro. That's Thanks, bro. We were on the cruise and somebody, somebody's like, hey, I called out. A, like, the boss called them. And they were like, yeah, you know, you're not at work. He was like, what do you mean? I am there. And then he goes, you're not here. He goes, why well, identify as transparent? <laughs> I said, what? And I know people are making fun of other things. I know they I know are. Really sensitive, but at the same time, when you put these things out there, 
it's, it's in front of us, it's right? In front of exactly. Us, oh, you want to be a Christian and da, 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 okay, like so. Well, I just did, for know, my I thing just, is I identify it as being invisible, so I don't have to see or hear anything you have to say to me. So thank you very much. Leave a message at the tone. <laughs> but you have to. You do have to do a little bit better with boundaries. I am, but I'm getting better. I am getting better. No, but that's what I'm saying. I just I want you to keep. Keep uh, listen. I'll keep on going forward. Keep on going forward. You know, I think I got into a point in my life where I was like, "Oh, family, right? We're always gonna be family." And you're not gonna think like you're gonna you're gonna do that for you, right? And I'm off quick. Yes, I'm a quick. You're a. (laughs) I'm trying to. I'm trying to. I'm trying to clap it with the ring finger. You're like, okay, well, maybe. No. Maybe. And I'm, I'm, I'm in your ear like, no, bruh. don't no. do it. Don't do it. So I think, so when I said that, they were like, oh, 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 oh. And I was like, I'm being really serious. Who said that? <laughs> My baby daddy. <laughs> I was like, I identify as um non-here and invisible. So please leave me alone. You know, so I'm... <laughs> But I'm putting up m- more different boundaries, and um, I'm happy where my path is going. Okay, good. I won't say good. where it's at. I mean, listen, it's been your it's been your path for twenty something. Yeah, it's really hard. You know what I mean? But I am it's happy where I'm at right now. And like I said, God's gonna give me whoever He needs to give me and and bring to my life. And um, I gotta listen to the right message, not the wrong message, mm-hmm. right? Because I think we humanize the message that's being sent to us. So that's great. I love that you said that. <laughs> I'm killing it today. I'm killing it. Y'all not ready for me. All right. So. No, but hold on. I have to say that. Sure. I love that you said that we humanize some of the messages that we get. That yes. is perfect because when we humanize it, then we become relatable to that message. Yo. And it's just not the right message. That's my bio. That's my bio. We're going to write your bio so then we can get off this topic because I feel <laughs> like we're we're there. Yeah. I but think we're there. It, though. Yeah. I, I love that. You're, yeah. I'm there. I'm getting there, T. Yeah. Yo, I'm getting there. And I didn't even have to get on a cruise to, like, drop that gem. You would not have gone on a cruise. I know. Cruise. Shut I up. I know. It's okay. Anyway, okay. we're going to cut it off right now um, and join no, us we next week. I appreciate you guys <laughs> being patient with us because yes. it's been a minute. Um, we have been busy lifing, but yes. we'll do better. Yes. Um. Just like God doesn't like leftovers. No. We have to make sure that we also do that for you guys. So yes. we're going to do a better job of communicating with you and just being vulnerable expressive and expressive and just talk about it, whether yeah. people agree with it or not. I yeah. think, um, I'll cry next time. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'll have you something to talk about. Crying? You plan- I'm a, like in the mirror. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. I am. <laughs> She's crying now because she's stressed. I don't know. Like, I, would, I don't know. Will I ever cry in front of the camera? That's mm-hmm. a nasty topic. That's going to be you it. You think I would cry in front of the camera? I don't know. Anyway. Anyway, so I'm Kim. I'm Tanya. Welcome. Bye. Off topic. Bye.